Good morning, guys. We are just getting lunch ready. Ruben's unhappy that he only got half of a donut. Um, I'm making myself a hummus sandwich. I have really missed sandwiches. So I'm, I'm planning out all the cool sandwiches to eat. And it's gonna be gluten and dairy free. So I'm using three baker's bread. I, I'm not a fan of this bread, actually. I won't buy it again, but I'm gonna use it up. And I'm gonna put roasted red pepper. I'm gonna put some pickles, some lettuce, some vegan cheese. And that's jello for Reuben. And whatever else I can find in the fridge. Here's my finished lunch gluten free pretzels, my hummus sandwich, and avocado with everything but the bagel seasoning. Reuben had half a donut, and he had some tomato, and he also had chicken nuggets, and he also had an orange. Becky, what are you doing? You're getting into everything. You're getting into everything. Daddy do this on purpose? No, it's not broken, Ruben. We'll fix it. It's okay. It probably just happened from you or Becky. What? Broken train piece. Go, 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 go. So today is day one without internet. And so far it's been amazing and peaceful and awesome and um, I'm loving it. I love that I'll be able to give my children a foundation where they know they can have happiness and joy without the internet in their home. And I love that I can protect them from seeing the bad things on the internet. And that they'll know when they grow up and move out, they don't have to have internet at their home either. Honestly, it takes a really strong conviction to stay away from the internet. I'm talking about you can even make Facebook an idol. Um, so... Now that we don't have the internet, if I want the internet, I can go to the library or to a coffee shop. And um, the internet is not in my home anymore. I love it. I don't think we're going back. And if you see this, it means I found a way to upload these without internet at home. I'm going to try church on Sunday. <laughs> What's wrong, Becky? Huh? I love you. <laughs> Whoa, be careful from mommy's table. So I have started reading David Copperfield by Charles Dickens. Ruby can do this whole puzzle by himself. He is really, really good at it. Good job. Time for Ruben to put the last piece in. Good job, we did the puzzle. Woo! That was close. Cool. 
Ruben fell asleep early, so Daddy and Becky and I are going to watch Harry Potter and open all of my thrift books that came today. Look at all this. Books. Thank you. 